Your computer crashes. Suddenly you're faced with the prospect of losing work, records, even family pictures. Well, there are a lot of businesses say they have the expertise to get your computer back up and running, but do they? Chris O'Connell here with a five eyewitness news undercover investigation. Chris. John, they go by names like geek and dog. Some call themselves revolutionaries, others renaissance men. But if your computer crashes, all you want to know is, can they get this thing back up and running? We went undercover. We took computers to seven repair shops around the Twin Cities. Each PC had the same symptom. Turn it on and you get an error message saying it can't find the hard drive. Right, well, that means you have bad hard drive. You couldn't need your operating system reloaded. This doesn't have sound. Do you have anything on there that you need? It'd probably be something with the memory or motherboard, possibly. Five suggested we leave the computer with them and pay between 59 and 85 bucks to diagnose the problem. But we already know the answer. If I just lift this end of the cable up just a little bit. Daryl Erickson teaches computer repair at Dakota County Technical College. Each of our test computers, he loosened the cable connecting the hard drive to the motherboard. When it, it comes up again, it's not going to see a hard drive. And I'll just sit there and hang. It's something he's seen happen with computers. Moving them around can jar the connectors loose. He says checking for loose connections is one of the first things he does when trying to fix a computer. It's a fair test, and again, I like fair tests. Oh, well, that was fast. Computer Renaissance in Eden Prairie called us within minutes of dropping off our computer. <laughs> Problem solved. He didn't even charge us a diagnostic fee. Circuit City in Woodbury found it too. There was actually a cable that goes from the hard drive and the actual board. I plugged that in and started right up. So did Computer Revolution in Roseville. Hey, it's idea cable was not fully plugged into the motherboard. But what we found at Best Buy's Geek Squad had us wanting answers from the company. I'm Chris from Chris the Channel 5. Nice I to meet you. Geek Squad is a fast-growing Twin Cities startup with more than 800 locations. The company's founder says it's the largest tech support company in North America. Can I get some to take a look? Sure. At the Eden Prairie Best Buy, the Geek Squad found the problem while we waited. Your hard drive, the cable for it was unplugged. We didn't pay a dime for that fix, but at the Roseville Best Buy, it can't detect your hard drive, so your hard drive's dead. The Geek Squad tech gave us a diagnosis without even opening the box. It's not even detecting, it's not even showing that, that the hard drive is installed. So it means it's physically disabled. That diagnosis didn't cost us anything, but it would have cost us a couple hundred bucks to install a new hard drive, more if we wanted to recover anything off the old one. But you're looking at a pretty expensive But we know none of that is necessary. The fix is very simple. The cable's loose. So we're going to push it back down. In about a minute, Daryl Erickson had the computer Geek Squad looked at back up and running. This is something they should have caught. $59 be able to tell you know what it is. At the Geek Squad inside the Best Buy in Woodbury, the tech told us our motherboard was bad. Which basically, it means that the main component of the computer is working. That says the tech is a four to five hundred dollar fix. This is kind of an old computer. Getting that fix would not be economical. You'd be better off just getting a new PC. And again, just the cable was up, so the way we left it. But after plugging the hard drive cable back in, the computer started right up. Erickson did more thorough diagnostics and concluded the motherboard is working fine. The Geek Squad missed a much simpler diagnosis. We went back to the Woodbury Best Buy looking for answers. We uh, brought in a computer here a couple okay. weeks ago. Okay. Um, we had some repairs Just done. Just real quick before, are you filming right now? Yes. Have you cleared it with our PR staff? We have not. Well, we did contact Best Buy's PR department and they sent us this written statement. Quote, our diagnosis relies on numerous physical tests, input from our customers and real life experience that confirms the majority of computer problems involve hard drive failure and virus spyware issues. Nevertheless, we made a mistake. Our service guarantee ensures resolution of all problems to our customer's satisfaction. Reporting live, Chris O'Connell, 5 Eyewitness News. Thanks, Chris. An early morning.